welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Marceline. Not Marceline. <coughs> welcome back to my channel, guys. If you are new to this channel, please make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you share. Make sure you comment. And you hit the notification bell so that you know when next I will upload. If you are not new, let me greet you and say, do me long, sonny bonane, zirik fire here, ika ko. It's your girl, Marceline, and you know how we do on this channel. Okay guys, as you can already tell from the title of the video, this is going to be a story time. Boop, 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 boop. And see. Okay guys, so today's video is basically me telling you how Facebook, books that face, facing of the books, books are facing that way. Facebook ruined my relationship. It was kind of my fault, but still, Facebook ruined my relationship. Okay guys, so basically I was 14 years old, yes honey, it's a 14, 1, 4, and I don't even know what I thought a relationship was at that age, because honey, what you doing at 14 dating people? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But anyway, I'm not judging anybody, if you're in a relationship and you're 14 and you're watching this, shine girl, flourish girl, you never know what you're going to learn from that relationship, oh cool. Okay, guys, so basically I was 14 and this relationship was fairly new because my boyfriend had asked me to be his girlfriend at the end of grade 8, which is form 1 in Zimbabwe. He bought me like this chocolate, you know, Cadbury or whatever, you know, and he gave me this big ass car, like, it was big, like, this big, and I was like, that's love right there. If a nigga gonna buy you a big ass car, he love you, boo boo, he love you, okay, let's go. So basically, now we were like in grade 9, which is form 2 in Zim, and we were dating, and can I tell you guys, that relationship, hmm, honey, it was plopping, ha, ha, hmm, hmm, because I was in boarding school, and he was in day school, so obviously I stayed on campus, you know, I could just, you know, be like, hey, boo, -boo do you want to see me, ha, 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 during the week, and then we could spend time with each other, or whatever, you know, just talking and laughing, like, hoo, hoo, oh, you so funny, oh, no, you so funny. Oh, you, so, you know what I'm saying? That's the kind of relationship that, you know, we had because, you know, we were cute or whatever. Like, I don't like to brag, but we were cute. So, yeah, we were 4, 15 now. Yeah, we were 15, 14, somewhere there. We were dating. Our relationship was driving. We were in the same math class. We were in the same Sean class. His friends were my friends, you know, that kind of old deal. And we would always be together most of the time, you know. It wasn't perfect. And, 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 but, you know. I was 14, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm in love, I'm in love with this boy, oh my god, you know what I'm saying, so like, yeah, we were dating, the relationship was driving, boom, 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 hitting all the right spots, I don't know which spots, because at 14, I don't know what kind of relationship, what a relationship really had to contain, but I was very mature for my age, might I add, and I knew that, you know, all you need is love, and that's on period, but now I know that's not all you need, but back then, that's what I thought you needed, you know, so yeah, and then, at my school, we used to have like a four-day weekend, and then we used to have the holiday. So now, it was the holiday, and obviously, the girl had to go back to Botwini, because I stayed in Botswana. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, I stayed in Bots, and he stayed in Zim, so obviously, we weren't going to see each other. And we used to go home for like one month, so I mean, considering we always used to see each other every day. A month was a long time. Like it was a very, very long time. And you know, it was a bit needy. So to me, I felt like two, two years, but it was just a month. So he never like used to call me. Like he never used to like text me. Like you know, we just used to talk here and there. Like it really hurt my feelings. Like I really felt like nah, this boo boo don't love me no more. Like why he ain't texting me? Why he ain't calling me? So I was a bit sour. Anyways, so yeah, so one day I'm on Facebook, you know, I get my Facebook friend request. I'm like, okay, accept, accept, accept. I just used to accept anybody because in my head, it didn't matter. I was never going to see those people anyway, so uh, it is what it is. So yeah, I accepted, and then there was this one person. One. Mwechete in Shona. One. <laughs> okay, first of all, his picture was a thirst trap. And it ain't my fault, you know what I'm saying? I'm thirsty, but like, it ain't my fault. It was just his torso in a towel. I looked at that picture, I said. My bad. 
mad ass. Hmm, okay. And mind you, my boyfriend ain't giving me the time of the day, so I'm just like, you know what? I'm a venture and venture and just talk to people, get to know some people, you know, so that I'm not always focused on him, not, you know, just focusing on one person. So I accept this guy's friend request immediately. He's like, hey, what's up? How you doing? I'm like, hi, I'm good. And he's like, what's in it? I'm like, Matthew. He's like, I'm, I'm not going to say his name. And then we started talking, what do you do? Where do you learn? <laughs> what's your hobby? So you like, listen, like he was talking to me like, all the damn time and my boyfriend was still not talking to me so you already know how the story goes right there if you are a petty sister then you already know sis petty get behind me because this story is about to take a direction you never thought it was going to take but you know it's going to take because you petty like me okay so he's like my girl, uh, my ex-girlfriend, you know, she's on my case and she doesn't want to leave me alone and I just need somebody to, you know, just say that I'm in a relationship with them so that she can leave me alone. What your girl do? I said, okay, let me think about it. Sis, you have a boyfriend? What, what, what do you think about? What do you think about? Because... Once you accept that thing, it's going to post it on your timeline. Everybody's going to know. And mind you, my boyfriend's friends were my friends. So they were going to see that. And they were going to ask me, baby girl, what's happening? What's going on? Did you break up with this guy? You know what I'm saying? And who is this new boo-boo? You know what I'm saying? But your girl was dumb or whatever. Is you dumb? Da, 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 dumb. Yes, I was. Because I said, oh, yeah, sure, it's fine. Let me help you. But from a petty perspective, let me go to my petty side. Boop, 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 boop. My boyfriend going to see this. And he going to get jealous. And he going to think that, wow, she moved on or whatever. He ain't going to take it too seriously. He's still going to stay with me. Boop, 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 boop. You crazy girl, you crazy. He cannot stay with me. But let's continue with the story. So, I'm like, sure, do it. He sent me the thing, I accepted <laughs> in a relationship with dot 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 dot. Two minutes later, his friend, hey, what's going on? Did you and Hing Hing break up? What's happening? What is this? Who's this new guy? Ha <laughs> ha! Just like I anticipated. But I was like, it ain't that deep, guys. He's just my friend. I'm helping him out. His ex-girlfriend don't want to leave him alone. So, you know, I just thought I would assist him. You know, we're just friends. And mind you, my boyfriend hadn't seen this at, at the moment, so he never said anything. So I went to sleep like a baby, like, you know, okay, whatever, it's cool. Waking up, honey. Ooh, I was in trouble. <laughs> my boyfriend never used to send long messages. Can I just, he used to be like that, hey, babe, hey, how you doing? I'm good. You know, one, one line the type of guy, one line the type of guy, he sent me a paragraph. Okay, boo boo. He's like, hey, what is this I see on Facebook? And my boyfriend was my Facebook friend, so he was obviously going to see it. You know what I'm saying? That was the plan. He's like, what is this? Who's this guy? I'm like, dude, relax. He's just my friend, you know. But yeah, I'm just helping him out, like his ex girlfriend. And he's like, no, you're making me look dumb in front of my friend. I think he was those, you know. You know, I mean, I can understand where he's coming from. Like, if that happened to me, I would be mad too. Like, I'm dating you and you, you're in a relationship with someone else and you publicly displaying it in front of all my friends. Like, hello, hello. So, yeah, he was mad, actually. And he said, like, yeah, this is so silly, what, what, what. And I said, but you never talk to me. You never give me the time of day. Like, you know, I was just helping out my friend. He really needed me. And he's like, I'm done. I'm like, what? Sorry, did I hear you correctly? He's like, yeah, I'm done with you, sis. I'm done. Dead ass. Cut the cameras. And I'm just there like, what's that? I was having an outward body experience. I'm like, what is happening? Like, he dumped me? At first I was like, nah, 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 nah. This ain't happening. You know, I was in denial. <laughs> I'm like, nah, 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 this ain't happening. And I was like, nah, nah, nah. He went offline. He removed me as his friend on Facebook. I'm sure he blocked me on an, on you know whatever we used to use back then in the day when I was 14. And I was like, Mustard, what have you done? Because I really love my boyfriend, guys. I really did love him, and <sighs> being petty cost me. <laughs> Facebook was an enabler. Can I just say that? But um, basically, I cried. In the tub, like it wasn't even like the 
He was more like, hey, 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 hey. I had to close the door and open the water so my family wouldn't hear me sobbing my eyes out. And like, when I was done, I had to like wash my eyes so that my parents could just think, you know, water got into my eye. But like, I was crying dead ass, you know. Yeah, guys, Facebook ended my relationship. It was mostly my fault, but Facebook helped. Yeah, guys, that's the end of the story time. Just boop, 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 boop. My boyfriend and I ended up getting back together. You know, he couldn't get enough of this sugar, of this melanin, of this <laughs> chocolate. Okay? Anyway, guys, please don't forget to like. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to comment and hit the notification bell. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mwah.